<laughs> All right, I got Captain Brian here. So you, you hooked into a marlin yesterday, huh? Yes, ma'am. We hooked a blue marlin yesterday. We was coming off over there uh, uh, about 03 and a 58 at everybody's uh, GPS readings. And uh, coming up out of that hole and hit the up well. And thought it was a big wahoo at first until the third run where it took us to the took us to the backing. And it ended up being about a 500-pound blue marlin after about two and a half hours of fighting. Oh, wow. You said you had it on the what? The 30 wide? Had it on a, had it on a pin squall 30. It was not prepared for that, but uh, <laughs> pin squall 30. So we had a pin squall 30 with a 60-pound braid and about an 80-pound uh, top shot main line with a 200-pound leader about six foot long and a little wahoo lure on there. We were completely overmatched. But. <laughs> <laughs> we got him up to the back of the boat, and uh, he ended up rashing us off and finally breaking the leader right there at the hooks. But uh, we, we had a good fight with him. He sounded oh, well. on us, drug us about five miles, and we had a good time with him. Customers uh, swapped off about every five minutes uh, for two and a half hours getting him up there. And y'all were just out, what, snapper fishing? We were, we were going bottom fishing. I was a mile and a half away from my first stop, and all of a sudden, <laughs> and, I mean, it was, it was <laughs> ripping. It I was love ripping. it. I, I had never seen, I've never seen a bite like that ever, and he was... He was every bit. He was 11 and a half foot long, somewhere around in that range. His tail fin was about four foot from tip to tip. Okay. Dorsal fin was about 24 inches. He was real. So you just never know what you're going to catch you out there, man. never know what you're going to catch. That's why you run your lines. That's why you go fishing. Let's go. I hear you. And that is Brian Kelly on the Screaming Dragon. All righty.